Hey, hey, this video is going to be an introduction to Parkinson's disease, uh, you know, the pathogenesis, what's going on, and then the four cardinal motor symptoms, which are the stereotypical symptoms, signs and symptoms of what Parkinson's disease is. We're going to go over them. Uh, this is very high yield stuff for board exams and for any sort of uh, neuro uh, class or exam or that sort of thing. Um, Parkinson's disease, what causes it? Well, the, the gist of it is that there's a decreased amount of dopamine in the brain, specifically in the substantia nigra. which is an, <clears throat> an area in the midbrain of the brainstem. So that's something to look up if you're interested in exactly where that's at. Um, but uh, you have an, a decreased amount of, of dopamine creating cells inside the substantia nigra, and that leads to these symptoms on Parkinson's disease. Now, what symptoms are we talking about? Um, the first one, which is kind of the most hallmark characteristic one, is the tremor. And the tremor has to do with the hand they often call it a pill rolling tremor. And what this means is a pronation, supination uh, tremor. And it usually uh, occurs when the hand is just at rest and sometimes even goes away when the hand's in motion. So this, you'll see this hand just resting on someone's leg, but then you'll see this four to six hertz, mean four to six revolutions uh, uh, tremor in the hand, pronation, supination. So supination, pronation, that'll just go back and forth. They call it a pill rolling tremor. That's the first cardinal sign. Uh, the second sign we're going to talk about today is going to be rigidity and uh, more specifically cogwheel rigidity. Now what does cogwheel mean? Well think about a cogwheel and that's one of these things like almost what steers a ship, right? There's these different spokes. And so you can think about if this is a cogwheel and these are these different spokes, uh, cogwheel rigidity is when if you have the arm in a certain plane and you try and move it, it actually moves like a cogwheel. So if, I, if the person puts their arm here, and I'm going to move that arm down, it doesn't come down like this in this one smooth motion. Rather, it comes down in a cogwheel or in this rigidity, this rigid motion down. It doesn't, there's no smooth, fluid motion. Um, the third is bradykinesia or akinesia, depends on who you ask. But uh, we'll break this word down here in a second after I write it. Brady means slow, or if it was A, that means lack of, and kinesia is movement. So these people are slow to initiate movement. If you asked a person with advanced Parkinson's disease to stand up from their chair, um, it would take them much longer than it would take someone without Parkinson's. They are slow to move. It's hard for them mentally to recruit their muscle groups to get their muscle groups going. And the last but not least symptom here is going to be uh, the, the fourth cardinal symptom is going to be postural instability. Postural is your posture. Instability is being unstable. So these people are not going to be very confident in uh, walking confident and just standing still. You're going to see a lot of falls, a lot of lack of balance, a lot of imbalance issues with these people. These are the four motor, uh, you know, hallmark cardinal symptoms of Parkinson's. Pill rolling tremor, cogwheel rigidity, bradykinesia, and uh, postural instability. Very high yield for tests. Parkinson's is caused by a decrease of the dopamine producing cells in the substantia nigra part of the midbrain. Um, treatment, at least in the you know in the beginning uh, stages of Parkinson's, is going to be trying to give that person a, a dopamine uh, agonist or a, or a replacement source of dopamine or a substitute, uh, something that's kind of like dopamine, to reverse or prolong these symptoms as long as possible. Uh, the you know the characteristic one is is a, a Michael J. Fox, this person who's affected by Parkinson's. So look him up on YouTube if you have if you ever are curious for a characterization of Parkinson's. Thank you.